Hello, hello, and welcome to your June 2019 Divine Energy Oracle Message for the beautiful sign of Aquarius. Hello, hello, Aquas. So, if you are new here with me, hello, hello. And if you are returning, welcome back. If you are subscribed to my tribe of beautiful people that I have coined the Marvelous Tribe, thank you so much for being a part of my family, my community. I love you guys. You already know that I am playing with my little fish here. So, which is um, amethyst, by the way. It's really beautiful. So, your message makes complete sense to me, Aqua, okay? Um, you have been through quite a bit, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. It's been a lot of um, dig deep type of messages calling you and thrusting you to do something. Do something. Does that make sense? This message is no different, okay? Your June 2019 Divine Energy Oracle message, and yes, they have been pre-shuffled to save time, is, what is that? Embrace your power. Aqua, before I get into this, let's do some past energy. Year in, you are being guided to begin to explore. January, refine your attention. February, reassess. March, rejuvenate. April, be decisive. May, reflect on your truth. You've done all of that. You explore, you refine your attention, reassess. You rejuvenate it. You began to make decisions. You start reflecting on the truth of those decisions. And now you are embracing your power. There is an energy that has been fighting you that has been life threatening. And I'm not talking about it feels life threatening. It feels like, put it like this. What do I mean by that? Not that someone has a gun up to your head. God, no, 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 no. Life-threatening, like, look, it's either me or you. It is me or it is you. And I'm not going down. That's what I'm saying. A battle. You're being guided to embrace your power. Let's find out how divine wants you to do that. Before you are able to fully express your divine energy and create an empowered life, you must assume responsibility for your choices, however good or poor they may be. Presently, you're being asked to reevaluate your past decision and uh, decisions and assess whether they have evolved you or devolved you. Be especially honest about those decisions that were made recklessly, emotionally, without self-control or reflection, Aquarius. Where are you now? Are you making impulsive choices or, or are you taking the genuine life and soul supporting risks? Pay close attention to the answer, though, okay? Because it reveals the root of any troubling conditions that you face. You've been going through these decisions, good, bad, or indifferent. Do they evolve you or do they devolve you? That's the question. Aquarius, your divine energy is calling you to elevate your personal power to a much higher level by taking responsibility for your choices and recognizing that they are the means by which you create your life. In other words, poor choices lead to poor creations. No exceptions. Poor choices lead to poor creations. No exceptions. I love it. Pay attention to the present choices and allow your divine energy to be the driving force behind them. Aquarius, your divine invitation is to evaluate previous choices without judgment. Which of your past decisions have worked in your favor and which one hasn't? Which one of those has not? Most importantly, what are you choosing for today? Now is the time to honestly start making choices that express your divine nature and serve your true soul intentions. 
First and foremost, did those de decisions evolve or devolve you? Secondly, secondly, what are you choosing for today? Aquarius. Good choices lead to good creation. Poor choices lead to poor creation. What has been created in your life due to a poor choice? Take, take, embrace, and take your power back. And every single choice or creation or circumstance that has been created out of a poor choice, take that power back and eliminate it. I, I just, this was beautiful. It's always beautiful when I'm talking to you guys. Always. Like, share, subscribe. I called you to action already. If you want to buy the Marv merchandise, you know where to find it. If you want to book me for a personal reading, you can do that. This is a non-tarot reading. I do am a full-time energy reader. Go check me out on the Readings by Marvelous Madame YouTube channel if you're here for the first time. On Facebook and on Instagram, these are non-tarot series that I have made to give my viewers something else. You, as I stated to Scorpio, were one of the reasons and inspirations why I decided to do that. I got tired of reading all this poor energy and I do not subscribe to a tarot card making everything better. We have got to do the work. You already know how I get down. It's your girl, Marv. I'm out of here. Aquarius, let me know how you're feeling about it. I want to know. That's beautiful. Do they evolve or devolve you? I want to know. And I'm going to put that in the description. Do your choices, have your past choices either evolved or devolved you? I want to know. All right. All right. I'm going to catch you guys here next month. I'm almost done. I have one video left. You know, we do these in order as the Western Zodiac. I'm out of here. Bye, Aquarius. It's always a pleasure.